YouTube. What's going on, fellas? It's your boy, Grant. Uh, we're back with another video. Today we're shooting, um, actually this is a back-to-back -back because I just finished up with the, uh, just finished up with the door handles from the last video and I decided, you know what, I'm gonna try another, another mod. So I still got the BMW in the garage. I've started to pull a little bit of this front end off and we're gonna take a look at these crossbars and see if, if it's possible to get them out easy and, and, and not have to pull the whole front bumper. So I'm gonna turn the camera around and show you guys what I'm looking at. Okay, so as you can see, we got the BMW up. I don't really think we actually need to have it up on jack stands. I've actually, uh, I've gone ahead and pulled out the front grills. Uh, of course, we did that by uh, unbolting these uh, these bolts here at the front of the, the bumper, uh, reaching in there and just kind of really getting that, getting in there, pulling and yanking. What's really interesting, when I picked up this car, uh, these crossbars, for some reason, I'm missing the bolt that actually, <laughs> the bolt's right in here to this metal frame. So I'm gonna have to get a new bolt for that, but I was trying to figure out exactly where uh, the crossbars are bolted at on the bottom. And as you can see here by what these these missing, now I'm not sure why what these actually here for these plastic pieces here. Uh, so we're gonna we're gonna see. I don't again haven't seen a lot of other other cars with those, but uh, when I'm looking here, uh, as you can see back there, I'm not sure if this is coming in on the camera, but where to go? There is a bolt head right there. I think that's like a T37, I believe that I'm gonna to try to see if I can snake in there and get that off. Uh, let's see here, what, it's actually a T40 because I've already tried to put uh, a, uh, uh, the, 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 um, the bit on there. I'm gonna try to see if I can snake through, get that bolt removed on that side as well as on this side. Uh, if not, I can, I can pull the front bumper. I mean, it's not that difficult to do. I just want to see if I can do it without it. So we'll see, I'll get to playing with this and I'll give you guys an update here shortly. All right, fellas. Well, that was actually less than probably 45 seconds. We got both bolts up. So yeah, we use that T40 as well as a magnet. Uh, the worst part is probably going to be getting those bolts back in, but we'll see here that that's loose now and we're able to, to pull that up. So there's the first one out. Awesome. Okay, so that was done. Uh, I'll check back with you guys here in a sec. Okay, so we got both crossbars out. Like I said, was not that difficult to do. So. Our next step here is going to be to scrub these down, uh, get them nice and clean. Uh, then I will hit them with a little sandpaper just to, to rough them up so we can make sure that paint will stick to them because I'm planning on painting them the actual same color as my brake calipers, which I have some left over there. And what I actually used on my brake caliper was some old uh, engine enamel paint that I had from uh, the old 240, uh, that LS Swap 240 that I built. So. Uh, we will get started with that now. Okay, so we got them all at least wiped down, got them cleaned down with some water. Uh, so now I've just got some uh, 320 uh, sandpaper that I had laying around. I'm just going to hit them real hard. I'm gonna go ahead and start, uh, start uh, sanding them down just so that uh, the paint will stick real nice. Uh, and then I'll see if I, I'm not 100% if I have, I'm pretty sure I'll find some primer, so we'll, we'll look for that here in a minute. Okay, fellas. So we got them all cleaned up, uh, got them sanded down, they're washed down. I'm gonna now hit it with some wax and grease remover. We found some sandable primer and then we'll hit them with the, uh, the paint. Um, I'm not going to waste your time having you guys watch me paint yet something else again. So um, I'm gonna hit it with these steps I just talked about and I will be back here shortly for you guys to, give you, uh, to show you the finished product. So, so that's where we're at now, we'll get started. All right, fellas. So we got day two, uh, and we've been having uh, the uh, the bars, just making sure that the the paint had uh, set up and uh, and cured properly. So we've got them all dry now. So now we're going to uh, go ahead and reassemble. So we're gonna pull the BMW back out, uh, send it in the garage, and go ahead and reassemble uh, these crossbars, and we'll see what we got. All right. Okay, fellas. We got the bars installed. So that's what they look like behind the grill. I'm still not sure if you guys, how about this? Comment below if you guys know what this whole vent is here. This kind of this, this structure here uh, in front of the crossbars. I haven't seen that on a lot of the other models. Uh, even uh, some of the guys posting on the forums don't show that and they still have a, a, a 2011 535. So I don't know if I, if I should just go ahead and pull that out or not. So comment below. Uh, but now what we're going to do here is I'm going to go ahead and uh, pull, it, pull, uh, pull the car out, uh, clean it, 
because it's actually uh, it's gotten dirty over the week. Uh, and then that way we can give you guys a final shot of what it looks like uh, through the actual the black grills and everything. So uh, we'll give you another update shortly. All right, boys. So we had to take a minute to go ahead and cut yard. So got that knocked out. Uh, because of that, we lost some light. So I've got it set up here in the garage and uh, she's cleaned up. And man, I'm telling you what, she is sparkling like nobody's business. So that's just a reminder here. It's the color that we got on the, uh, the brake calipers, which is the same color that we have now on our crossbars. So uh, I wanna get in the light here, but you can see crossbars in there, man. It looks really killer. I really, really like it. So hopefully that's doing just doing it justice, but uh, it definitely looks really, really clean. Uh, so uh, that's it. So um, again, appreciate you guys tuning in for another video. Don't forget to like and sub subscribe. I wanna keep bringing mods and, and new content for you guys, but uh, I, I really like this one. I, I think it looks really good. Uh, I want you to hear you guys' comments below. Uh, let me know what you think and let me know what you guys uh, would like to see next. All right, we'll talk to you later. Everybody be safe.